Whoa. Well, welcome back, everyone. I had to make a few changes to a couple things because I was getting... Oh, wait. Why did I do that? I was getting some pretty, uh, pretty buggy behavior here. So now I have a few unknown nodes. Which I will be throwing out. But I now have... Wait, that's uh, not what I want. I'm going to throw it up there. Um, I had to disable some mobs. As you remember in the last episode, I had some problems with trying to make food. More rotten meat. And the problem was mainly coming about because the crafting guide I was using here didn't support group types, which were called on in quite a few of the recipes that I was trying to make food out of. So, with that being said, I changed that out for a different mod, which does the same thing here. And I can now go through, well, should be able to go through, clearly it's not working right. And clearly I don't know how to spell peach either. Okay, this still isn't working then. Whoa, whoa. Okay, I have no idea what I just did there. Um, what was it called? Pie? I think there's some pies. There we go. We have pies. Yep. <laughs> hey, there we go. Blackberries, flour, and sugar. And we can say flour you get from wheat, and wheat you have to grow. Which, hey, what do you know? I have wheat growing out there, but it refuses to uh, ever show up. I'm hoping this rotten meat will go away at some point, because I have no use rotten meat. I can't do anything with it. Um, what do I have? Three wooden planks. It's not enough to really do anything. Gravel and cobblestone. Um, still waiting for the night to pass. I think I'm going to throw the bones in there. I don't know what I'm going to do with dirt. Let's throw that in the chest. I don't want that on me. Uh, wooden hole. Yeah, we'll throw that there. Wooden sword is junk. Wooden pickaxe is junk. Ugh, a sand heap. For a second, I thought that might be flour. But of course not. Okay, I think... We're gonna do the... Base level here. And we're gonna do that in cobblestone. It'll give it a bit more of a... Refined look. I don't think it actually has any advantage over anything else, but it gives me something to do to pass the long night hours. And then maybe at some point we'll even uh, go through and use all the same colored wood instead of having, uh, I don't even know here, two or three different wood types like I have right now. I don't need to get rid of the dirt. Yay for having no more dirt. Dirt just looks terrible. Ooh. He can't get through a window, can he? I would imagine not, but I'm not going to take the chance and risk it. Um... Hey, yo, zombie dude. Uh, zombie, rather. I don't know who made the decision to call them zombies instead of zombies. Oh, hey, you got into my yard. You know, I have a fence, man. You're not supposed to jump fences. Or are you? It would make no sense. What's the point of having a fence if it's... Whoa. 
He's not going to stop these critters. I love how he can he can attack me through the door. That was really a stupid thing to do. But I can't fight him through the door. I, like, it's not fair. Go away. Go away. You goofball in a suit. I mean, come on. Why, why is he in a suit? That doesn't make sense. Um, let's see here. I don't think I can... I don't have any wood on me anyways. It's getting sunny out. Hopefully he's taking damage. That's weird. He doesn't have a health bar above his head. Does that only show... Come on. Leave. I can't cook raw meat, can I? Try cooking some jungle wood planks. Cooked meat. Now dead. Okay, we'll see what happens here. I don't know how dirt got up in there. I actually gained a little bit of... Or I lost some hunger, rather, from that. Snow? Man... Telling you, how do those guys get in here? I'm gonna die. I just know it. They're jumping over this fence somehow. Are they climbing trees to get in? I mean, I thought the idea behind a fence was so bad guys couldn't get in. And yet, wow. And yet, all that ever seems to happen is bad guys get in. Well, my useless garden is definitely not growing. I'm going to have to go... Go hunting and try and kill a cow. Whoa, I just like went inside of it. Die, cow. Oh boy. You have quite a bit of health, don't you? Moo! You also look kind of ugly. Cow is something I need to recreate. Um. Maybe or maybe not of interest to anybody. I am working on a mod of my own, which is going to incorporate quite a few fire elements. Oh, I don't really have any wood to burn. Uh, most importantly, come on, jungle wood. Okay, so I don't jungle wood planks work. Cooked beef. I don't. I really don't know. I suppose I should find out how long uh, cooked food will last before it spoils. One would hope it would last a little longer than uh, just the raw version. But I haven't really looked into that, so... I don't know. But anyways, back to... Um, Back to my mods and stuff. I'm working on a mod of my own, and then I have actually just a little earlier today I finished up creating a goat, which will be added to the which will be added to the I think simple mobs, but I'm not 100% sure. One of the mo bone stop appearing up there. I'm not 100% sure which mod it's going to be added to. Yes! Finally. I'm not starving. Um, but yes, 
So I just finished up a goat, and that'll be getting added shortly. And I'm kind of thinking, seeing as how I modeled the goat, which in my opinion looks pretty nice. So I'm kind of thinking I may just go ahead and uh, go to that mod folder. And I might turn the... Why can I not put a piece of wood down? I might turn the cowl that there is now into a little nicer looking cow. Which could be a nice little touch. Okay, I have water right here. And a mushroom. How can I get the water? Oh, there we go. Let's see. Um, I think buckets are all made of metal. Of course they are. And I have no metal. Um, let's try a pot. Oops. I always forget. You hit enter and that closes it. Flower pot. Plastic flower pots. Okay, I guess that works. Potato chips. Dude. Yum. Um. I know I had a watering can mod. Wow. Um. Don't even have a crafting recipe. Well, how's the body to make that? Water lily? A well base, but you don't get water out of it. Watering can? A water mill? <sighs> Looks like the only thing to do is... Mine and... Hope to hit stone. Uh, not stone. Obviously, you kind of have to have stone in order to do mining. Hope to hit some metal. I may have to do that. After I get some wood here. I don't know how many pieces I will need, but... Got a full stomach. Feeling good. I'm going to just chop for a minute here. Say, what's happening to these trees? I don't get it. It used to be I could cut the bottom of a tree... And all of the wood of the tree... Was that an airplane? No, those are birds. And the whole rest of the tree would just come crashing to the ground. And you would get all the pieces. And that doesn't work anymore. I don't know if that's because I don't have item drop. That mod enabled anymore. Which, if you have played Minecraft or if you've seen Minecraft videos. You will know after you finish harvesting something like this. It just falls to the ground in node form, and you have to either walk next to it to pick it up, or click on it to pick it up. Um, and in this one, right now without that mod, pretty much you just chop it, and it appears in your inventory, regardless of how far away it is. See, that one worked. That one gave me all of them, so why isn't the tree? I wonder if the tree is coded differently than this thing is. I love that. I got 25 of these already. All I've done is attacked three. Whee! Now those, I th think... I think I can do it too, yeah. I don't even have to attack the bottom one. Just everything above it will fall. Oh no. It's gonna crash. Okay, let's uh, just relaunch it and see if it'll work. There seems to be some sort of a bug with the forest mod I have. And I tried turning it off on a copy. But then I had, like, a world of unknown nodes from every single tree. And all the leaves on the trees were all unknown nodes. It looked really, really bad. And I was like, no, I don't want to do that. Because that just looks terrible. So I went ahead and obviously kept the version that has that whoa a floating torch oh that's new i didn't know i could have a torch float and this one doesn't all fall apart if you cut the base Lame.
just cleaning some ground here. I don't know if this is how the this is how the zombies have been getting into my yard. They've been climbing up onto that and then jumping over. Yeah, let's uh, take that torch away because that looks silly. I don't know how they've been doing it, but it irks me. And because it only makes sense to have a straight fence. I'm going to put a straight fence in it. And even though I can jump over my fence, I feel it would be uh, a little more believable if I threw a gate in there. So I may just have to find myself some gate pieces. Oh boy. No! Die, you horrible beast. Die the horrible death you deserve. See, how do they get in here? There's a fence surrounding my property. Okay. Where is that meat? And is it still... Wait, I didn't eat it all, did I? I didn't think so. There we go. Cooked beef. Time for a snack. All right, so let's, let's do a little orgs and guys in here. I get four sticks from one of those? I don't give me a nice lot of sticks. I wish there was something I could make out of sticks, but... Sticks go down, please. Let me continue harvesting sticks from these lumps of tree trunk. There must be something I can make out of sticks. Okay. Nice, please. Alright, and 20 pieces of jungle wood. Making plenty of jungle wood planks. Bushes I can get twigs from. I <laughs> get more sticks from twigs. Yay, because I need more twigs. Uh, more sticks, rather. Grass I can chop or something, I forget what. Unidentified mushroom spores. Okay, I'm thinking... Another forest error? Okay, well, I think I'm just going to end it here. Seeing as how it's pretty much been a day anyways. I'm going to try and figure out what's making that bug. And hopefully have it fixed by next time. So, I'll catch you then. Thanks for watching.